how you doing? So today is Saturday and uh, week, it's a weekend. So I hope everyone is enjoying their weekend and their weekend rest. So my friends here, uh, my friends are here. They come over to, uh, to have a get together and we're going to do some cook up. Is it cook up? You cook? Cook up. Cook up. Yeah, it's a cook up or a get together. Yeah. So we, we would like to share it to you what we're going to do tonight and I hope you can stick around and join us. So first thing, what are we going to do today, Lisa? We are making a pavlova. Pavlova, all right. Okay, so what do we need for pavlova? Okay, we need five eggs separated. Okay. One cup of caster sugar. Uh, <laughs> Corn flour, I can't remember. <laughs> so we have to put our uh, ingredients in a container. So that's corn flour. Two teaspoons of corn flour. Two teaspoons. Oh, that looks more than two teaspoons. Oh, no, that's two teaspoons. Okay. One teaspoon of oh, vanilla essence, sorry, and one teaspoon of vin vin uh, vinegar. Vinegar, yes. Alright, where, where is oh, the vinegar? Oh, I'll do that later. We have to grease our pan, put some uh, spray oil and a baking paper. paper. Right, so okay. now, and you need to set. Oh, yes, set. and we will set our oven to 150 for the first 20 minutes. Okay. Uh, and then when the first 20 minutes is done, we lower it to 120 for 50 to 60 minutes. All right. Okay. It's approximate. So what do you want to do? You want to set the oven for 150 degrees. Is that all? Yep. Okay. So we will set our oven to 150 degrees. 150 degrees. So what's next? Right, first we need to separate our eggs. Okay. I'll, from the I'll have to get the camera and make it closer. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> so we have to separate the yes. egg white and the egg yolk. I like to separate them into cups just in case you get a rotten one. You don't want to spoil the rest of the eggs. So do you going to, are you going to use both? No. No. No, you, you can use your yolks for something girls make some biscuits or or a custard. Okay. Yeah, which is what I've done. So we're only the going past. to use the egg whites. Yes. Put them in there. It's a bit of a slow process, but it's better than ruining your first lot of eggs. Okay, where are we? <laughs> we are at, we have completed separating the eggs, the five eggs. We now need to turn the mixer on and okay. um, beat it into a soft peaks ball. I reckon, I reckon that's, yeah. I reckon. Yeah. So it's already, okay. yes, it's ready. So it's ready. So, yes. It's already, what, stiff? Uh, stiff peaks, yes. Stiff so, peaks. Yeah. Nice and, nice yeah. to see. Yeah, nice. And are peaks. you going to do the test? The test? The test? Oh, uh, no. No? <laughs> so I don't trust the test. You don't trust the test? Come on, do it. No, no. <laughs> Oh, all right. Test. Let's do it. Let's do the test. Hang on a minute. Hey? 
But she's going to do the test. Yeah. 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 Do you want to help her to catch yeah. that in case yeah. the test will fail? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, the ready? test. Ready? One, two, three. Yeah. All right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it yeah. works. The test works. It worked. Okay, yes. so what's okay. next? Uh, also, when you're mixing it, you've got to make sure there's no gritty sugar. So it's got to be nice and smooth. Okay. Okay, so now you put it onto the tray. And you can form whatever shape you like. You can form a rectangle, oops, circle. Now I've got to leave some in the bowl to lick for later. All right. <laughs> make sure you lick that one. Oh, yeah. Because I don't have water. <laughs> Our oven is heating up to 150 degrees. It's ready for our pop -up. Right, now we stick it in the oven. So for how long? Oh. Um, for the first, we put it on for 20 minutes. To, I think it's to brown it up. Mm -hmm. And then after 20 minutes, you turn it down to 120. Okay. Um, for 50 to 60 minutes. The oven, hopefully, it's worked. Ow. Ow. No, no, <laughs> so we're taking the poblova out. Yep. And you're supposed to leave it in the oven turned off. And, um, and leave the door ajar so it will cool down in the oven but because there are other things cooking in there mm -hmm. we'll have to take it out and put on the top of the top where it's still um, a bit warm. We will let it cool down yes. before we're going to decorate. Yes. To, all right. Yes. Okay, so what are we going to do next, Lisa? Now I'm just going to whip the cream. So... It's about 600 ml of um, just thickened cream, but I've got another one here. This is only a small. Yeah, I just put them all. <laughs> just put it on. And now I'm just going to add some, just a little, um, for starters. Um, so what is that? That is um, icing sugar. Icing sugar. I think it's about a tablespoon. Okay. But I don't generally add too much. Not all the table. Not all the tablespoons because it can be quite sweet. So okay. we'll see. I'd like to test it halfway through. See if it's enough. Because the pavlova can be quite sweet. So yeah, what's next? Gonna, we're just going to add a little bit of pink food colouring to the, just to ooh, make it pink on top. That's all. Whoops, I think it's going to be bright pink. Yes. Beautiful. All right, so, All right, so now we're going to do next. Just going to plop the cream on top. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Oh, yes. And we need the raspberries. Just the ones. So we have our raspberry for yeah. toppings. So did you mash this one? Yeah, that one I mashed. So mashed with sugar. sugar. Yep. So we, we mashed the raspberry. And then we put some sugar, and we also need a whole raspberry. Mmm, that's beautiful. 
This one here is not so much a marshmallow one, it's more of a um, <coughs> chewy, 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 um, chewy, so pavlova. A chewy pavlova rather than a marshmallowy one, yeah. which I actually probably prefer than marshmallow. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'll get this all on film. Emily's <laughs> um, enjoying it. Mm, yum. Okay. Now, what's next? Well, mm, yum. <laughs> and. Just can I so it? It? you most certainly can. Mm. Mm. Oh, and just beautiful. Got you sort of want, don't really want to cover it too much, otherwise you'll get too much. Um, uh, if you come to raspberry, raspberry, and we'll just sprinkle this just over the top, just to. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can't see the cream anymore. Yeah, you have too much of this. Yeah. So can you put something else aside from raspberry? Absolutely, you can do bananas, and you can do kiwi fruit, any any sort of fruit you like, or even chocolate. But I quite like the raspberry because it takes away a lot of the sweetness from the. So it's like a sweet and that sweet sour, sweet and sour maybe. Yeah. <laughs> um, you know, we, we could spend a lot of time, we could spend a lot of time presenting this beautifully, but we're just going to hold into it and eat it. Okay. Yeah, I know. I love it. Oh, beautiful.